Hello, ladies and gentlemen, as always, Brenda Misu here, and welcome to episode 14 of my Minecraft Let's Play series. And, um, whoa, craziness. We're at the chicken farm, and you'll notice two layers of chickens. And I decided, since some people might not remember to do the thing with the, uh, uh, chicken chucker mark 28,000, um, so I came up here and added this extra layer. Now these chickens will stay up here forever. They're, they're never going to fall. And um, I'll probably use the next couple patches until I get a good amount. So I have a steady supply of eggs. And then that way I'll always have a supply of eggs to kind of throw back in here. Um, that way it's completely renewable. Even if I have like... Even if I have that dispenser fully loaded and I unload these and none of the chickens from that dispenser get back up here, um, you can see there's the water down there that they will eventually, um, that I'll get more eggs and I don't have to worry about finding more eggs and whatnot. So it's kind of a foolproof kind of thing. Um, and then um, I repaired my pick. Went to the ender farm. Got lots and lots of ender pearls. Ooh, that went really far. And repaired my pick, I think, three times. Which got it pretty high up. It, the next level was going to be uh, something ridiculous. Like 39 levels to repair it fully. And so I just didn't do that. And then I remodeled this room. Um, added in some nice flooring. Um, added in this thing on the ceiling to give it not so gray. Um, moved this wall in like two blocks. Um, that way it was symmetrical, you know, because I was trying to do something with the ceiling and it just wasn't working simply because of having this here and having these different, but now it's, uh, symmetrical. I moved the sign in memory of Peter the Pig who died happy. Um, here's the chicken chucker, and then I moved the signs around a little bit, activation switch of course, nothing in there right now. That's because I'm actually going to use these eggs for something else this episode. Um, and then I got pigs, uh, obviously don't kill all the pigs, and don't kill all the cows. It took me a while to freaking get this many in here, but, um, it's happening. Nothing really up here, but there's not really much point. Maybe eventually I'll, I'll add something. But in today's episode, if you remember, someone did something to me. And so the war is going to be sparked. Someone messed with all my signs. And from that, the war is going to begin. And I'm almost 100% sure it's Tyler. So... Even if it wasn't, I'm still, I'm still doing this. Um, and I'll go ahead and show you what I'm going to do with what I have. All right, at this moment, let's check that guy. Wow, that kind of sucked. Oh god, I'm going to land in water. Really? <laughs> okay. <laughs> there we go, that one definitely went over. That was actually a pretty good throw. Um, hi, Creeper. Bye, Creeper. Ah, save me! Save me! There we go. I like... He originally made this wall for Creepers. Now that I think about it, Creepers can spawn up there and just kind of... Be like, hey guys, how's it going, guys? Hey guys. Um, so I'm not going to show you the full thing of this thing. This full thing of this thing, the full uh, deal with my prank, but because Tyler does watch my episodes, but I'll be showing you what I'm doing, and I guess a good place to start would be somewhere like here. This one will be pretty easy to find. Um, actually, that's the pick I want to use. Ooh, that's not good. Uh oh, okay. Let's put that back there like that. Like that. Take 
that guy back out. And now... Oh, some bitch. Oh, wait, they can stay there. There. Oh, man, how am I getting out of here? Oh, <laughs> whoop. There we go. Oh, man. I love you, Tyler. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. And that's going to be the extent of my prank. I'm going to be putting these all over his house over the next bit. And uh, it will be fantastic. Tyler, I love you. Um. <laughs> yeah. So I went back to get some more eggs and uh, decided to come check out the view from up here. And it's actually kind of cool. I mean, you can see the the iron golem farm from here in my place there and then there's the chicken farm and the beacon um, the guys' place is over there and then Tyler's place is there you can see the mine track that BJ had made that will be going soon um, and this looks pretty cool actually from up here I kinda like it anyways back to uh, chickening up his area okay well I feel that his house has been Successfully chicken fied. Um, so, pretty much that means I can stop uh, throwing chickens in there and start putting them in here. And with that, we're going to decide on a farm to start working on. Um, so, now we have all these done, I believe. And, uh, yep, sounds about right. Let's look at this and see if we have any done here that um, aren't really done. Someone might just got mes message me. Um, why are there two pistons in here? You can't make a piston farm. <laughs> um, yep, there we go. <laughs> so, hmm, let's think. I kind of want to finish up the rooms that we have so I think next up um, for the rest of this episode we'll try to set up the smooth stone and um, cobblestone generators I'll probably go into the test world and dink around with those and figure out how it all works and try to come up with a, a design that will work for inside of that um, and whatnot so um, there is that, and yeah, so let's, uh, let's go ahead and move these guys over. Um, the wool farm, man, that is just kind of a pain in the butt, especially since it's not going to come out right, because I miscalculated um, the room size, because um, there's 16 or 17 colors, one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. So fourteen would line up with this. Fourteenth one would be right here. Um, fifteen, sixteen, I suppose. And then I guess right here I could put something. It's in itself. Um. Tyler, Tyler. I'm pretty sure these are all Tyler. I don't remember. I don't remember if I put them there or not. I don't think I did. I think Tyler did. I think I put a few. I don't remember. Oh, man. He's just throwing these flowers all over my base. Um, there's patches here and there. I'm surprised I don't have some in there. Because he hasn't been on in a while. Um, but, yeah, that's just some ideas for that. So I kind of want to finish up that. Um, I want to edit this to be brought up as far as it can, I guess, to make this. Because right now this is kind of ridiculously long just to get down here to get some bones. Um, and all it would actually require me to do is move all this. Actually, I wouldn't even have to move any of this. I would just have to move the pistons up. 
move the piston setup up and I can probably bring that up um, the issue with it is since it's kind of like right here the lowest I would be able to get it is you know to like right here but even then I could it would be nice just to go down and then right here and then another turn around the corner and not have it ridiculously deep but at the same time that seems a little impractical um, changing this entire thing just to shorten up our walk a little bit I'll probably spend more time working on it than down there since we don't use that for XP anymore um, but I think I kinda wanna close this off and close this off and just move the nether portal forward to like right here or something um, then just close this off and kinda just make use of the room that I actually have and I think what I'll do um, no 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 I won't be doing that but like moving this stuff out and turning this room into a farm of its own um, the main issue is I need ways up and I guess what I can do is do something here to get up I don't know um, but yeah we'll go ahead and start working on those things okay so I figured out the two designs I'm gonna use um, these probably aren't the best thing but um, I think they're gonna turn out pretty well um, this is the smooth stone one so it goes like this um, there's obsidian in the back so that way I can just hold down the button yes I lose some um, I could stand here and I will uh, gain a few more back I won't lose as much because I'll end up picking them up um, but it's hard to get the right angle um, but occasionally I'm trying to get it to happen now oh god damn it not again um, and that's why I'll just probably stand here um, unless I switch that block to obsidian or something uh, but occasionally the lava will load in faster than the water and when that happens um, it kinda breaks the whole system um, here let me show you what would happen so normally something like this would happen um, the lava would flow down and then turn the block right here next to the water um, into s cobblestone and that's where the water is one back and then I have these here which push ex uh, two sticky pistons out and then uh, pull the blocks that turned into these two and then this water will flow back down and then I can just continue to break that's another reason I would probably stand here over underneath because it'll be easier um, and that kind of thing so I mean yeah I lose quite a few I suppose um, let's see one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty so I lost about half. Now that's not very good, is it? Um, now I could do something. Yeah, there we go. Just broke like that. Just yank that in. Break those two blocks and voila. Um, now I could do something like using a fire resist potion and then standing inside of the lava while breaking those blocks um, or like right next to them so I guess I'm going to go and try that real quick game mode 1 I'll just go ahead and splash resist me and then get me up here and I guess what I would do there is um, I could switch this to a lever so let me go ahead and do that um, that way I can extend it out Ooh, but that won't work 
Um, I could add another set down here or something. Um, and then I would just stand up here, game mode zero, make sure. Okay, now I'll just stand in here. And I guess I just do something like this. Stone on the edge. Oh, and just like that, start flowing. Luckily, the water won't kill me if I get in at that spot, but. Um, I honestly don't find it very effective. Um, but it's, you know, even if it's not like 100% effective, I'm still getting blocks. Um, maybe eventually I can uh, come up with something better. Like the main thing is, is I'm trying not to, uh, whoa, craziness. Um, I'm trying not to like copy every single design I do. Um, I'm trying to come up with some of my own, like this is not anyone's that I know of. I mean, someone probably has something extremely similar, but as far as I know, this is mine. And a smooth stone, it's just kind of hard to set up. You can't really set it up in much a way to have it just work. Um, and I plan on having two of them, pretty much. So, um, these would probably be hooked up to their own, because the reason I would have two is so if someone else needs to use it, they can. Same thing with this. I actually have this semi set up for two. And this is all this one is. Ooh, this one is uh, more prepared. It's got the obsidian in the back. And even this one isn't, I mean, 100% efficient. I think it's more efficient because blocks aren't as likely to go left. I mean, the problem with the other one is just that blocks hop up a little bit, you know? Um, so that's an issue. But, I mean, it's... I'm able to set up my G13, or not my G13, my... Uh, my keyboard in such a way that I'm able to hit a button and it will just continuously do it for me. Um, that would work better than this one because this one I have the whole lava flowing faster than the lot than the water thing. But um, you know they they work all right. So I'm gonna go ahead and build those, and I'm actually gonna check how much time I have left. So I kind of wanted to do something since I don't really need the eggs anymore actually before we go and build that. And that is to test this chicken cooker, because we have yet to actually do that. Um, so let's go ahead and try it out. Chicken mode. And voila. Um, let's go ahead and... Uh, oh, that did not work. Oh, son of a bitch. Because I don't even know if this will work, to be honest. Cause there's no chickens coming. No chickens coming right now, which actually has me a little bit worried. Actually, has me really worried, cause all the chickens should be coming now. Um. Hmm. Let me go check this out. Good thing I decided to test this because uh, kind of sucks that it's not working. So we'll head over there and see um, if the piston didn't extend or something or or what. Um, let's see any chickens? Nope. Still don't see no chickens. So my guess is there's something obviously not enabling something to go off so that's what we're going to go check um, oh yeah they're definitely still in there that's my guess
That was the dumbest way I could have done that possible. Yeah, so all those chickens are still in there. Um, let's hop down here. Break away that block. Can we... Nope. I'm trying to nick on that. Uh... Okay, so the water is still out. Right now. Alright. Let's go ahead and hop down in here. No? No? Oh, yes, yes. I just forget how... I decided to build that. So that's the issue. There's somewhere in here that is not working. Um, so I guess we probably won't actually get to the uh, one thing today, which is okay by me. I'm kind of in a rush to get everything done. So let's find where this is broken. Let's see, that's off, which goes all the way up. Blah, blah, blah. Is there... That might fuck things up. So let's just uh, hop over. Okay. Um, so the lever was down, which would have powered all this, which would have gone to over here. And there's our issue. We need to get it into here without getting it into here. Um, that was our issue before. And I don't have any redstone, so let me go get some redstone, then I'll be back. So actually, all I need to do is, if I understand correctly, is just break this and put a piece of redstone dust there. Um, I don't know where I can get some redstone dust. Do I still have some down here? Okay, right, cool, I do. Let's actually uh, break up all this. Um... So I went up there, and one of them was not, um, was not switched, okay, so the eggs no longer are coming anywhere, nor are the chicken, um, so there's just a single source block of water up there now, so that means this needs to stay off, um, this needs to get turned off and all these need to switch to let the eggs fall. So all I have to do is put that block right there so we don't have a crazy circuit going. Break that block, I believe. And then add this dust here. Um, I don't know how to get out of here. Yep, I heard the things switch here we go uh, and let's try getting up here now I don't know how I got stuck on a torch ah some bitch that's going way the fuck over oh no no that's bad too god damn it <laughs> oh my god Oh no! Son of a bitch! <sighs> Fuck. Let me just build a tower up, I guess. It's kind of obnoxious that I have to do something like that, but whatever. All my chickens are still down there. Oh, but they're all right here now. So, why aren't they... They're not going because of that block, eh? I don't want to kill any of them. Let me uh, get the good pick out, break a little bit faster. God damn it. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. Okay. Uh -huh. Fuck. Okay, so now all these guys should fall down. Except for that rebel. Let's go ahead and kill him. Okay, I'm 
trying to think if I did this right. Yeah, now I just need to put the signs back. I need one, two, three, four. How many do I got? Three. Crap. Oh no, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. Some bitch. Oh, I have no ender pearls. Oh man, this is not good. Um, okay. Um, oh, I'm such a little cheater. I'll have to come back here and fix this anyways, so. Oh no! No, 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 no. Don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. What have I done? Okay. Let's just put that back. Let's just get up with this. Come on. Now these chickens are getting flown down into it somehow. I don't know how they're... Oh, probably because of this water stream. Yeah, now they all get flung. Oh man, this guy sucks. <laughs> and for some reason these guys aren't going down anyways. I guess it takes a while, huh? Oh, son of a... Oh my god, what have I done? What have I done? Oh, that's why I had originally done that. And then I was supposed to go... Nope, nope, didn't make it. Nope, 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 nope. What? No way, okay, there it is. God damn it. You can't tell I'm a bit flustered. Let's just break this fucking block. And, uh, let's head back to base. And see how many chickens we get. Um, let's just actually toss that to the side. Don't want that kind of, uh... Well, I mean, technically I would have got those anyways. So let's go and pick this back up. I might hear my dog running around. Okay, it's uh. Okay, well, it looks like they all made it here at least. Okay, there we go. So nothing fucks up. You might hear people in the background now. Awesome. Okay, here we go. Really? That's it? Oh man, that fucking... Oh, fuck a duck. Okay. I'm actually gonna probably hand throw these back in. Okay. <laughs> wow, I talked a lot trying to fix that chicken thing. And I really apologize for people being loud in the background if you can hear them. Um, that's literally all the time we have left for. I kind of rushed this episode, didn't do anything super cool because I'm... I'm just out of time. So thank you guys so much for watching, please comment, rate, subscribe, and all that kind of good stuff.